broke the rules. He went to the above world. A man was drowning. I had to save him. This obsession with humans has to stop. I just want to know more about them. She wants to know more about the overworld, and we want to know more about this movie. This is gorgeous and stunning, and hey, we have Halle Bailey as a Black Mermaid. I mean, nothing can go wrong with this remake from Disney. Joining us now is movie critic Kathy Kaiser. Kathy, thanks for being here with us today. Thank you for having me today. Of I'm course. super excited. And you and I saw this movie last night. Yes. So I always love it when we can good. see a movie together. Yes. Yes. And I can actually say, hey, this is what I thought about the movie. Exactly. But what did you think <laughs> about the movie? I thought it was absolutely incredible. You know, when you go to remakes and you're thinking, how much are they going to mess with the original story? Mm -hmm. Not a lot. Yeah. The things that they did to make it more modern day totally fit. You, mm -hmm. broke mm -hmm. the rules. you agree? See the music. The yes. Lin Manuel Lin Miranda had, had his stamp on <laughs> this music from the very beginning. Yes. Yes. There was comedic More relief. Them. Sebastian is always great comedic relief. Right. Flounder. Flounder. Scuttle. So cute. I forgot Aquafina about Scuttle. Aquafina okay. Scuttle. Come on. Aquafina was Scuttle. And when I tell you, her voice throughout the entire movie just had me cracking up. Like everything that came out of that bird's mouth. <laughs> you were dying laughing, right? I was. I loved all of the fish puns. I loved just looking at not only the beauty of the live action, but right. to see the beauty of Halle Bailey. Oh, absolutely. Just she gorgeous. was gorgeous. She was perfection. Yeah. And Jonah Howard King as, as Prince Charming. Prince, yeah, Prince Eric. Yeah, he was just as dreamy. Um, yes. I was like, who is this? <laughs> Let me do a quick Google search. Those right? eyes, beautiful. Oh, it that was. I was gonna say, and I really think that the animation, the live action mm -hmm. animation, mm -hmm. was better than maybe another movie about the sea that came oh, out, right? That maybe begins with an A mm -hmm, and ends mm -hmm. in a Vatar. Yeah, uh -huh. maybe, mm -hmm. yes. Mm -hmm. I think it was better we'll take, than that. We will take, especially <laughs> with the, the live actions really kind of coming out all the time now yes. on big screens. Yes. This, was, this was good to see. It was beautiful. It was pretty. I think my favorite scene was under the sea. Oh, absolutely. It was bright, it was fun. You saw all of the, the underwater creatures interacting. I felt like a kid again, honestly. Oh, absolutely. And I love Melissa McCarthy mm. anyway. She was she incredible as Ursula. Absolutely incredible. Nailed it. Every <laughs> movie has to have that villain. Right, that and character. she was so good. So that good. role was meant for her. Absolutely. Let's talk Absolutely. about King Triton too. Okay, Javier Bardem. So he just he was perfect. He, perfect. <laughs> he looked so dreamy. His hair was just flowing in the wind. Well, I guess not the wind. The ocean. The ocean, right? <laughs> it was so just good. Yeah, and I really did. You know, the songs that mm. were added totally worked. Mm. Right. Yeah. I mean. Alan Menken and Howard Ashman wrote this movie back in the 90s, if you can believe yeah. that, right? That's Maybe hard. late 80s. It was late 80s. 1980. So I was telling you, yeah. I don't think I've actually seen the, seen original. the original. You've only seen Little Mermaid 2. I've seen Little Mermaid 2, because Little Mermaid 2 came out. I'm giving away my age. <laughs> but it came out when I was about four or five. So I remember seeing that movie, but I actually don't recall seeing Little So to see everything on screen last night for the first time, I was like, oh, wait. Right. I know the songs, right. but I actually didn't know the full plot. So. Oh, it, so it totally worked for you. It did. It totally worked. How many popcorns are we giving this one, Kathy? I'm giving this one four out of five. Four out of five. I'm going to say five out of five. <laughs> it was so good in St. Louis. You have to go see it. Halle Bailey nailed it on screen. The music, the mermaid outfits, everybody did amazing. And the movie itself just... It also reminded me that fairy tales do come true. Absolutely. They still come true. Absolutely. Don't ever stop dreaming. Thank no, goodness. keep dreaming. Keep dreaming. All the way to the box office. Amen, girl. Amen. <laughs> you can check out The Little Mermaid in theaters now. You can also find Matinee Chat with Kathy Kaiser online. You can show us some love on Facebook and on Twitter. Again, it's Matinee Chat with Kathy Kaiser. Show her some love, and we look forward to seeing her right here on Studio STL every single Thursday. Kathy? Thanks again. Thanks so much. Don't go anywhere, St. Louis will be right back.